Hello people, this is Iron Man Fan 147. I just thought I'd do a little quick tutorial on how to um how to um kind of take textures from Halo Reach and put them into Blender. Um now this is an example of my background. This is actually of me. I actually I was playing Firefight and I got stuck through the ceiling. And I thought it looked funny because it looks like an elite just walked in with me like coming down from like some sort of a air duct or something coming down and sneaking up and getting back away before he notices me and he's looking at all the dead bodies like huh you know so i thought it was a funny t it was a funny thing so i'm going to show you how to pretty much put your um screenshots from halo reach onto your computer now what you're going to do is if you have halo reach you're going to go into theater mode which is yeah, like say you play a game and then you go into theater mode and you can like watch yourself play the game but you can have this free camera thing if you press Y and you can go around and if you I think it's like X and then if you press the little screenshot button it will take a screenshot and you just have to save it and that's all you have to do and then what you're going to do once you save that screenshot it doesn't have to be in your file share but it could be if you wanted it to be but you can open up your internet browser and type in www.bungie.net and then you hit a and then you hit enter and it should take you to this now you can also do this with Halo 3 and Halo 3 ODST but here's what I'm, I'm just gonna do this oh and apparently you can do it with Halo Halo 2 as well but I'm not sure I'm not sure if you can get screenshots on those because I haven't played those like I haven't done any screenshots on them so I don't really know if you could but if you could, I guess you same thing applies with this. So I'm gonna go to my Halo Reach stuff. So right here where it says find your stats, I'm gonna click I'm gonna put in my gamer tag. So there it is. Now I click find your stats and it should take me to this uh, screen. Right here, and there's my guy. It shows me it shows me how much of the game that I play, what my favorite weapon is, how many kills I've gotten, my favorite weapon, um, how many games I've played, how many medals I've earned in those games, and shows my character, that's my guy, ODST helmet, because ODSTs are awesome, shows me my wins and losses, but over here is what you want, it should say under file share, you go down until you see recent screenshots, and you click on that, and here's some things I have, I have this crate, this crate from the top view, this, uh, this bridge, medium sized bridge, um, a 5x5 five five block, and I have all these other pictures I've just taken. Here's that, here's that one that I was talking about. Here's just some things I've saved. I have a lot of pictures of outside of the map if you want to check that out. I'm Supster 147. So there it is. There's a Sarah from outside the map on Night of Solace. It's a lot. Or, yeah, Solace. Solace. I don't know if I'm saying it right, but what you do is you take a picture of a side and a top view of a model, like this. So I have the crate, right? And then you go back, and you, what you do is once you find it, you're going to click download high res and just open it. You don't have to save it, but, I mean, you could. Now you go, you make it as big as it possibly can, and then you copy, go into paint, and paste it and then save as I already did this I'm just gonna say save as in my texture um, bridge halo reach texture and then you're pretty much just gonna save that and it should save right into the spot you put it now what I'm going to do is go into blender right here so I'm going to just make my model of that thing I made. Too bad you can't actually rip models from the game. That'd be kinda cool. That'd be modding though, so I don't mod. Unless if it's like a computer game. So I'm going to pretty much put a texture on it. And since you just download this like from a screenshot, you're gonna have to even the stuff up. So I'm gonna say open I have my stuff on my desktop, game textures, all this stuff. Oh, what was it? It was like... I think it was this one. Yeah. 
So it was this one. So there's my bridge texture. Which, well, if you named it bridge, you're going to go to bridge. But now I'll go into textured. And you should see this. Now what you're going to do is you're going to... Um, pretty much these little vertice points, you're going to drag them over until they line up directly with the object so it's straight across and you just get rid of these vertex points you're just gonna move them over until it looks perfectly like that then I mean since this is a bridge I'm just going to extrude it down a little bit so it makes it look solid um, take these things out extrude them out on the y-axis I'm gonna bring these up that's gonna be my bridge railing so now I have this but I can I can texture these two since I didn't already do that didn't model the whole thing before I opened it so I'll just I'll just do the old view from bounds thing and just put them on this this thing right along here so now it should look like that I'll do the top too Pretty much all I'm doing is just making my own model, but instead I have um, a template to go by. Pretty much, I guess you could say. So the only thing that I'm doing here is just taking a texture or a screenshot that I've made on Halo Reach, gone to Bungie.net, downloaded that picture off the internet that I took myself, and just texturing it straight to my model that I made. So now you have a Halo Reach medium bridge or whatever you did I also have the crate pictures and such but yeah I mean tell tell me what you like I'm not sure if you can do this with black ops if you could that'd be amazing so I could definitely use that but uh, yeah this is how you do it um, hope you liked it I doubt many people are gonna look up how to put halo reach textures into blender but um Anyone who regularly watches my videos, I guess, will see this and they'll think, hey, cool. So hopefully this benefited some people. I'm just kind of bored, so I decided to make this. But anyways, goodbye. Hope it helped. Peace.